All right, I'm gonna walk you through the pavement test that we've created here at UVU. Uh, first thing you notice here is we've got our e-stop. That toggles the power to the 120 line. If the 120 line is unpowered, we'll cut power to the 230 line. Uh, we're running 230 for all of our three-phase motors and 120 for everything else. Moving on, you'll see that we've got the wheel mounted on a hub to our geared motor. Our geared motor is mounted to this L-frame uh, that can hinge on this actuator. Moving in from that actuator, you can actually see here on this side we have the blade actuators. You know, so we've got parallel linkages here on the side to drive the blade mounting point up and down. Uh, the power coming into the machine wraps on top of this um, exoskeleton frame serves as a safety feature to keep people from getting into the machine as well as route the wires. We come down through this all-weather slip ring. Uh, you can notice here that I can move these wires freely uh, through the slip ring. The power comes down into the box. We've got a three-phase relay, got all of our mounting connections, power supply, and motor drivers. And the last item I'll point out here is a very key pivotal point. It's the uh, center pivot that we've got, and this is where our mounting points are for the asphalt anchors. Thank <laughs> you.